The 2014-2015 CUNY Athletic Conference kicked off the year as student-athletes and coaches gathered from every school at Lehman College for the CUNYAC SAC Leadership and Coaches Rules Seminar presented by the U.S. Army. Founded in 2006 by the Student Athlete Advisory Committee, the SAC Leadership Seminar helped set up the student-athletes with opportunities to not only excel on the playing field, but also in the classroom by bringing in guest speakers to help pave the way for the players. So in the event's ninth year, CUNYAC welcomed the United States Olympic Committee in a panel discussion that included Kelly Skinner, Scott Rywald, Alicia Kendig, and Ambrose Serrano. Over the 90-minute discussion, athletes and panelists dabbled on various subjects such as nutrition, psychology, overall performance planning, and strength and conditioning. Helping an athlete, someone that has come up through from being a kid they first got introduced to a sport, Playing uh, at high school, having an opportunity to play at the collegiate level is fantastic. Whether they get to be an Olympian or not, it doesn't matter. Because the fact of the matter is that they're going after what it is they want to have. They, they have a goal in mind. So, again, I just hit on success a second ago. It's about how it is that they're going about being successful, what it is they can get out of this experience. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity. So few of us are really ever get to be collegiate athletes. So, the fact these athletes are here, they're interested, the coaches are here, they're interested, and they want to kind of go and learn even more about how do I integrate these things, how do I help myself be better, it's always very exciting for us. So at the end of the day, sport performance is sport performance. After the panel discussion, guest speaker Bob Wolf spoke to the student athletes about first impressions and communication skills. You walk around, you see somebody, it's okay to smile. Because you know what will happen, you'll smile back. Oh my God. Oh, oh. Way to get somebody to feel good about you. Honestly, Mr. Wolf, he kind of caught me by surprise because I wasn't expecting this speech at all to go in the direction that it did. He did a lot of per like points on like good person skills and all that, and like as in like and as a student athlete, someone's looking to get a career in the future. I never realized how important this would be in the future. The student athletes understand three things: they know how to compete, they know how to deal with adversity, and they know how to be determined to be successful. So those are the things that businesses look for in people all the time. So if I've hired people in my life, probably 300 of them, I've looked for student athletes, I've looked for actors, I've looked for singers, anybody that knows how to engage people and compete. And while the athletes were packed into the gym, coaches from all senior and community colleges had their own panel discussion with the USOC, followed by their own guest speaker, Brandy Hathaway of the NCAA, to converse on new and old rules for the upcoming year. Well, coming from the Division I, uh, spectrum. There's a, there's a bunch of different things that we try to encompass at that level. It's a, maybe a little bit different in Division Three. So for me personally, um, it's different to see the different regulations that don't always apply to the Division One schools that may apply to Division Three and vice versa. So for me, that's the biggest thing. But also to have all the coaches and stuff in one room for the conference, I think it benefits well. And especially having any time you can bring in the United States Olympic Committee to advise on anything, it's always a plus. And it's going in a good direction for the conference. So with all the rules explained and no stones unturned, athletes and coaches are ready to pass on their newfound knowledge to their respective teams and do what they do best, just play the game. From Lehman College, John Perez, CUNY Athletics.